This is the championship trophy for the BBC International Television Sheepdog Trials and today both the singles and doubles finals are being run off here at Buttermere. The setting for the trials is absolutely superb. The Grey Lake lies in the valley below, towering fells up on each side and it makes a perfect amphitheatre. And in the bottom, the amphitheatre is the green field where the trials course is laid out and the trials are just going to commence. The teams in the singles finals are Scotland, who narrowly beat England West, and England East, who just pipped Wales by one point last week. David Shannon has had a marvellous run in the semi-final of 97 points, so the morale of Scotland is high as he goes to the final. And the second singles handler, Bob Fraser, for England East, has also been setting a very high standard, and he got 90 in the semi-final. The brace teams are Scotland and Wales, so there are still competitors from all three countries in the final. Veteran John Gilchrist for Scotland has all the experience of the years to help him, and Glyn Jones, who had that superb 99, is the other doubles final competitor. But the stars of today have come a long way since they were no bigger than this litter of whelps that we saw at the beginning of the series. Well, Eric halsell has been doing the commentaries on the trials for us so far, and Eric, you've been around the circuit so long that I reckon you've got uh, sheepdog blood in your veins and wool under your hat, so <laughs> yes. what you got your money on for the final? Oh, you can lose friends by asking questions like that, Phil, but uh, you're putting my head on the chopping block, aren't you? Nevertheless, I'll, uh, and wagering isn't allowed at international sheepdog trials, but I'll, uh, I'll stick my neck out and... Uh, Partly on the brace, I'll go for uh, I'll go for Glyn Jones with Gellan Bracken, but uh, the other two, the other two, I think I think Glyn is better than uh, than John with his brace running. But what about the singles? Now then, now then, that's a much tighter job, is that? No, the uh, singles. I think we'll leave that to the judges. They're too close together for me to pass an opinion on that. Right, well, here's Bob Fraser with Phil trying to improve the one-point lead that brought him victory last week. No, you're quite right. Bob Fraser, who is respected throughout the world for his skills as a handler and breeder, goes to the post, 100 points at stake, and of course the championship, the big championship. Oui. Phil, clever. Placid but determined bitch, who has actually improved as these trials have progressed. Goes nicely to gather the sheep. 20 points involved there. And she stopped nicely there and she's got full points. Covered lovely. Hey, team! Just a word from Bob that she's doing the job nicely. Quite lifted. 10 points out of 10 for the lift there. This is a way to start a winning run. Bits there, nice and steady. Sheep, quiet and hurried. Now then, a drop of water going in. Point going. Point going. Get them back online, Bob. Hey there! Just another little bend there as he comes to the turn. We, 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 yeah, we, yeah, oh, we, yeah, oh. 17 out of 20 scored on the face. Three drop there for the good bend. Pace 
this in nicely. Starting this triangular drive. Going well. Straight through the middle of those gears and look at the speed there. She did. Accelerated there to give us a, a really good turn there. Just this word from Bob down again, just to keep her in trim. But she's steady on her feet. Pure movement, pure artistry of movement. She's just standing there, ready to go up as she goes. Everything under control. Another nine, panic creeping in. Just getting a bit too low there is Bob. You see, and he's just had to swing a quick there, and this has just brought a little panic into the situation. Turned all right, but this lovely flow of movement suddenly slipped. One of these sudden things that go wrong in a trial could really cost him. Back again, you see. Settled nicely. They're into the shedding ring. Slip. Yeah. Done and finished with. She's taken control again. 27 points scored out of 30 there. Three points gone. At 74 points towards his hand run. Feel ready for anything. Ready to answer any command she gets. Chance at the end. Want the ribbon cheap off. Go straight away. Straight away. Yes, come through there. That must be clear. Ten out of ten at the shed there. Eighty-four. Now this is setting the ground standard for this final. Perfect understanding, man and dog. It came. Ten points to go. Swell little sheep there. Nicely settled. Bitch in control all the time. Turning them lovely there. Not letting them slip up the pen. She Wonderful. wants them in that pen just as much as Bob does. Yeah. Yeah. And they've no option but to go. And that's it. That must be a clean pen. Ten out of ten for the pen. Giving a total of 94, which is four better than this semi-final.